This poem is called Secret Children. A desert, a wasteland, cold. Something terrible. Thousands and thousands of crude wooden crosses. The skeleton of a child nailed to each and every one. Close your eyes and imagine this. Imagine your own child in this place. Imagine yourself. Winter winds whip the bones of these children. Rib cages frozen in fear decades ago rattle but keep their secrets still. Between the bones there is ice. Inside the ice there is fire. Within the fire there is a secret, the secret that keeps them here. Each child is brought here by an adult, a trusted friend, brought here, exploited, split open, left here, left to hang in this bitter wind and commune with ghosts. The child never had a choice. These children have families that love them dearly, blind families that will see no evil, deaf families that will hear no evil, dumb families that will speak no evil, families that cannot believe a child's body knows the difference between fantasy and reality. Are you sure you're not making this up? Families that cannot believe their beautiful children could have been taken away, but you were such a happy child. Families that cannot believe this could ever happen to their own children not in this family. Families that cannot believe the words sexually abused could ever describe their own children. No secrets in this family by God. It's not too late for these children. They await resurrection and salvation. They ache to be healed but cannot do it alone. Fathers, mothers, brothers and sisters, lovers, spouses, families and friends, they need you. Take them down from these crosses. Trust them. Welcome them into your heart. Love them. Hold them close and warm their coldest places. Hear them. Feel their fire and honor it. Believe them. One secret at a time. One child at a time. Believe them.